This is my first Christmas train set that I've ever owned. If you guys have been following my channel, you'll know that uh, I've been collecting O-Gage trains now for about three and a half years. And over those years, I've built a pretty good collection of Lionel and MTH trains. But I've never in my whole life had a Christmas train set before up until today. It's pretty cool, you know, I'm, I'm used to having, you know, the fancy legacy vision line engines, the MTH DCS engines with all the bells and whistles. And so when I ordered this, I, I figured, okay, this train will be pretty cool, but uh, it won't be as good as my trains on the uh, Peabody and Merrimack Valley uh, Railroad. But to my surprise, uh, I got a kick out of this, this, little, this little set. It's, uh, it's got some cool little features. Um, I think Lionel did a really good job with this set. So I'll be going over the, uh, all the, the, I'll be going over all the cars and, and the engine uh, in detail. So let's get started. So like I said before, this is Lionel's Lion Chief Plus starter set. Uh, it's a Christmas themed uh, set and it's called the Winter Wonderland Express. It comes with an 080 steam locomotive, a box car, a tank car, a three dome tank car, and a caboose. And because I I'm a train person, I decided to get a few extra cars that I'll be going over uh, so that, um, so I will start off with the locomotive. So this is a, uh, like I said, an 080 steam locomotive. It comes with puffing smoke, an LED headlamp. It, um, it's got white, the, 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 uh, the, the majority of the locomotive is white with uh, red accents. The steam dome, the sand dome are all red, and then the front of the boiler is the front of the uh, the engine is is uh, silver, so it's very uh, well, very nicely decorated, and the cab is like a like a dark green, and it has one two two one on the uh, side of the cab. So moving to the tender. The tender has got some nice graphics. It says Winter Wonderland Express with some pine trees and snowflakes above the lettering. You can see a pine tree on the right-hand side. Uh, at the top of the, the uh, tender is red and the uh, sides are white. The light on the back portion of the tender right here does not light up. It's just for looks. Okay, continuing on with the uh, first car, it's the Winter Wonderland Express box car, and it says Sleigh Bells and Company on the front with the Winter Wonderland Express on the back portion of the box car. The, uh, the door opens, the doors open, and it's got some uh, load capacities over here. You can't really see it, it's kind of small but it's got the load limits and the capacity numbers right here. And it's red on the sides and uh, dark green on the top and the doors are dark green also. So this is the second car that comes in the set. It's a three dome tank car. It's uh, red on the bottom and uh, dark green on the, the uh, tank portion of the car. And it says Winter Wonderland Express on the rear portion and then on the front, the round logo says Whimsical Winter Mix, which I think is, is uh, pretty creative. Uh, and then there's um, a metal, separately applied metal 
uh, bar that goes around the the uh, all, all around the tank car with a with a separately applied ladder on the side. So it's really cute. I, I think they really did a good job with this um, with the graphics and the, the the wording that they put on here. It makes it a really really cute set. And with the last car that comes in the set, it's a um, it's a uh, comp uh, it's a caboose that says uh, Winter Wonderland Express North Pole on the side, and it's got a it's white with uh, red with a red roof, and the platforms are a dark green, and it's got snowflakes on the behind the uh, behind the lettering. So uh, now I'll I'll show you guys some of the extra cars that I added. Like I said, I I just wanted to have more than just three cars getting pulled behind this engine me being the train guy so i decided to buy a couple of extra cars so i will show them to you now and then we will do a running session so this is lionel one of lionel's christmas box cars that they put out this year and it says merry christmas to all 2019 and it's got santa and a snowman and some pine trees with some snowflakes and it's a nicely got some nice graphics on it uh, and I liked it because it's got 2019 on it uh, something to signify the first year I had my my first uh, Christmas train set and it's the sides are black which is kind of interesting for a uh, for a Christmas train usually you think of green and red and white and so, but they, they decided to use black, but the uh, graphics are real nice. And the uh, sides, the, the, the ends and the top are uh, red. So I couldn't just go with Lionel. I decided to get a, uh, a couple of MTH cars. Uh, I really like what uh, MTH has done with their Christmas and their Halloween trains by adding LED lights. This car really, uh, really shines brightly. Um, I was excited to get this. I figured this is like the highlight of all the cars that I have on this set. So it's got um, two uh, Christmas trees that are decorated and they actually light up. And you'll see it when I run, run the set. Uh, each tree lights up. They're little mini LED lights. And in the middle, there's, um, there's a, a package or a shipment and it says Santa Claus and Friends, North Pole. Ship this side up. Merry Christmas. When empty, return to the North. Return to North Pole, which I think is really cute. Uh, the uh, it's it's more of that uh, whimsical um, theme that they have for uh, for Christmas. And it's got uh, it says Merry Christmas on the bottom, and you've got Rudolph on the uh, on the left hand side on the round uh, over here. On this right over here and the uh, trees actually have little presents underneath them and a little tiny uh, train running around the tr around the tree just like this and the last car I'll be talking about is uh, another one of MTH's cars it's the uh, it's uh, the manger scene and it says Merry Christmas on the bottom and it's white and you can get several different themes that they have. I decided to do the major scene, but they have the um, they have the shepherds, um, and they have like one or two others. And the figures and the star up above light up, so they illuminate. So this this uh, this whole train really uh, really lights up nice, and that's that's the reason why I got these two cars because I wanted to add some lights. I think the LED technology is really cool. It really brightens up the train, really says Christmas. So some other features I wanted to talk about briefly about the uh, Lion Chief set, the um, the the Winter Wonderland set is that the uh, some of the features of the locomotive, instead of the um, when you hit the bell, Instead of getting a traditional train bell, you get uh, the sound of sleigh bells. And I'll, I'll, I'll be showing you that when I run the engine. And then when you play the sounds, uh, one, of the, one of the features that I think is really cool, when you, when, you, when you play the actual announcements, you know, these engines, if you're familiar with Lion Chief, 
uh, you can hit the announcements button and you get um, you get different announcements depending on if the train is moving or is stationary. But one of the features that I like about this set and part of the reason why I bought this set was that it plays Christmas music. And what it'll do is when you when it starts playing the Christmas music, it shuts the sound of the locomotive off and the only thing only sound that's coming out of the locomotive is the music. And it, what it'll do is when it gets to the end of the song, it plays it again. I think it just plays it continuously until you hit the announcements button again, and then it shuts it off. And then when you hit the announcements button again, it does, a, you know, it does the, the traditional um, announcements. And I think there's two or three Christmas songs that this engine plays. So I think it's, it's, really, it's really cool. And one of the other things that I got with this set was I decided to get the the smoke fluid I got the pine scent smoke fluid uh, just to kind of go along with the Christmas theme and it it really smells like a real pine tree and I think it's it's a nice a nice touch to the uh, to the set so enough about me rambling let's get started with uh, I'll show you guys what this set looks like uh, running around the tree and then what I'll do is I'll, sh I'll shut the lights off afterwards so you can see it when it's running in a little bit uh, in a darker environment and you can really see the LED lights uh, so uh, here we go oh and one thing I forgot to mention about this set that's uh, kinda important is that it comes with Bluetooth it, you can run it on your phone or your iPad uh, and you don't have to use the the handheld remote that comes with the set so that's another nice added feature.
So I just wanted to give you guys a closer look at the uh, MTH uh, car with the lit up Christmas trees. Again, I think they did a really good job. The LEDs are really small, but they're really bright. And it really adds a lot of uh, light to the, to the train. And here's a close-up view of the manger scene, the MTH uh, flat car with the manger scene on it. And you can see the, uh, the figures light up. The, even the manger lights up. It's got little lights on the side and the corners. And the star above lights up. So again, it's a really nice, a nice um, lit up car. Okay, that uh, concludes this video. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, I really enjoy this uh, train set. I think Lionel did a fabulous job with it. Uh, it does, the engine doesn't have the details of a legacy engine, but you, you can't really expect that uh, when you're pay, paying this price for a uh, starter set. It's a starter set, so it's not supposed to, um, have all the bells and whistles. It's supposed to just get you into the hobby. So uh, I'm really happy with it. I think it's a it's a cool little set that um, I think will bring me years of enjoyment. So um, we'll catch you guys in the next video.